Hey, this is Blake Drummer for Urban Apocalypse, and I got our recording room studio, so let me show you the mixer. It's our Yamaha MG102C 10-channel um, mixer. It's nice. Sound quality is awesome. This cable right here leads down to the recorder. This is a small... Well, an old recorder, but it's got very good sound quality. This cable right here leads to the keyboard or mix or uh, synthesizer. This cable right here leads down to the direct box for to another cable leading to the bass amp. This cable right here leads to the drums. Obviously, you can see it's only one microphone for the drum set, but um, this microphone you can uh, hear every single instrument that's going on. So, here's the microphone for my drum set KSM27 Sure. Nice microphone. Works great. Um, this cable right here needs to vocals. It's not yet set up. I don't have a stand for the microphone yet, but I will get that. So here's the microphone. It's a Samson R21. I don't know if you can see it, but it's, you can see the lettering. It's a nice microphone. So, let me show you the instruments. This is my drum set. It's a nice drum set. And uh, here's the microphone for it. Only one microphone. Captures everything, every sound. So, this microphone, the microphone that goes here is great. And, I mean, like, uh, it could be completely silent. You plug the microphone in, and you can snap from all the way across the room, and it'll catch it. So, here's the drum set. It's got bells, sheet music, or, or songs. A song we didn't record yet. Um, Hi-hat, some toms. Some, yeah. <laughs> Cymbals. Yeah, it's a great setup. And a cowbell. Can't have a drum set without a cowbell. Over here, this is where Charlie, our singer and um, electric guitarist, stands or sits. Um, this is a stand for his music when he's singing. It's also got a light if you can't see. And over here is where Joe, our bassist, Stand or sits. Um, plug this cable into his amp and you can record it. So here are mini discs. I can plop right into here. I'll read and say blank disc. Yep, it says blank. So that means it's good for recording. Right here, um, we have two shelves and one empty space. This empty space right here, we will put an amplifier for our speakers. And this cabinet right here has some stuff, some extra stuff. Um, for uh, recording right here we have tape in case something breaks um, a remote for the lettering up there right now it says urban apocalypse yep right here we have labels for the CDs so we can um, label our songs here we have um, USB for and little USB for um, connecting to the a recorder to the computer, recording book, um, 
pasty thermal cleaner. I tried this stuff three times and it works very well. Uh, drum pads, screwdriver. Um, on our first floor, we have cables in case um, we're going to add anything else. We have ends of microphones in here. We have a drum machine. Dr. Rhythm. Rhythm. Cool drum machine. I recorded something on this. It's cool. So, um, here's the amplifier that I will put in. Me and my dad. Sideways. And there are some acoustic panels. Stuff I need in case I break something while I'm drumming. Another Rototom. My other video in our music videos, you probably noticed that I had a third one. Well, here's the third little one. I took that off because it was kept on hitting the hi hat. So might be going. No. Oh, Oh, he took off his third rototom. Oh, I didn't notice that. Well, I'm telling you now. I am. I did. Here are some headphones. Third shelf that we took out. We also took this shelf out because it has no rail. Got it for free, but it has no rail. There's a shelf for putting odds and ends in there. There and so. That's our recording studio. Listen to our song. Goodbye.